engine drivers here on Sir Topham Hatt's Railway. Sometimes I drive Thomas, but Thomas is working abroad at the moment. I bet he's seeing some marvellous views. We get quite a nice view from this signal box. It's raised up high, so the signalman can see a long way down the tracks. I can see James waiting for me down there. Oh, I feel like I'm flying high in the sky, like Harold the helicopter. <laughs> that reminds me of a story. Harold flying high in the sky while Percy steams along the tracks below. Yes, here it is. It's called Percy and Harold. Percy worked hard at the harbour. An airfield was close by and Percy heard the aeroplanes zooming overhead. The noisiest of all was a helicopter which hovered, buzzing like an angry bee. One day, Percy stopped near the airfield. The helicopter was standing quite close. Hello, said Percy. What wordy great arms you've got. They're nice arms. I can hover like a bird. Don't you wish you could hover? I think railways are slow, said Harold. And he whirled his arms and buzzed away. That Harold thinks I'm slow, said Percy. Just wait, I'll show him. Percy collected his cars and started off. Soon, above the clatter of the tracks, they heard a familiar buzzing. There's Harold, called Percy's guard. He's not far ahead. Let's race him. Go for it, Percy, yelled the guard. The fireman shoveled coal for dear life. Well done, Percy, shouted the driver. We're going ahead. Far ahead, a distant signal warned them that the wharf was near. The driver shut off steam and used Percy's brakes, so they rolled under the main line and halted smoothly on the wharf. We've won! We've won! shouted the fireman. Harold's still hovering. He's looking for a place to land. <laughs> so, Percy's not so slow after all. And just like Percy, I think nothing beats travelling by railway. <whistles> oh, I think it's time for James and me to be out on the tracks again. <laughs> See you again soon. Oh, hello there. I'm Mr Perkins. I'm one of the drivers on Sodor. Usually, I drive Thomas, but he's off working in other countries at the moment. I do hope he's being careful and not racing around. Thomas does love to race, especially with his good friend Bertie, the bus. I remember when Thomas and Bertie first met. <laughs> 